Therefore, O Lord, as we celebrate the memorial of the saving passion of your Son, His wondrous resurrection and ascension into heaven as we look forward to His second coming, we offer you in thanksgiving this holy and living sacrifice. Look, we pray upon the oblation of your church and recognizing the sacrificial victim by whose death you will to reconcile us to yourself. Grant that we, who are nourished by the body and blood of your Son, and filled with His Holy Spirit, may become one body, one spirit in Christ. May He make of us an eternal offering to You, so that we may obtain an inheritance with Your elect, especially with the most blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Saint Joseph and His spouse, and with the blessed Apostles and glorious Martyrs, with Your blessed Apostles, Saint Martin, and with all the saints in whose, in whose constant intercession in your presence we rely for unfailing help. May the sacrifice of our reconciliation, we pray, O Lord, that bands the peace and salvation of all the world. Be pleased to confirm in faith and charity your pilgrim church on earth with your servant Francis Benaventura, the order of bishops, all the clergy, and the entire people you have gained for your own. Please and graciously to the prayers of this family whom you have summoned before you. In your compassion, O merciful Father, gather to yourself all your children, scattered throughout the world. To our departed brothers and sisters, and to all who are pleasing to you, and their passing from this life, give kind admittance to your kingdom, there we hope to enjoy forever the fullness of your glory. Through Christ our Lord, through whom you bestow on this world all that is good. Through Him, and with Him, and in Him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, our glory and honor is yours forever and ever. That with the help of your mercy, we may be always 
free from sin and safe from all distress. As we await the blessed hope in the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ has said to our apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but the faith of your church, and graciously grant our peace in the unity and unity in accordance with your will. We live in the reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Blessed are those who are called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed.
please all kneel for prayer against the death penalty. Father, source and giver of life, we lift our hearts and voices to you. Help us to build a society that truly chooses life in all situations. Let our response be, Lord, heal our pain. For those experiencing pain and anguish because of violence and crime, response, for perpetrators and victims of other cities who both struggle with anger and hatred, response, for our broken world in chained by the desire for revenge, response, for our wounded society, misled by the illusion that one must take life in order to defend it. Response. Let us say together, help us to make peace. For our country tempted to accept violence, revenge. Response. For the conviction to recognize the uphold dignity of all people. Response. For the wisdom to see poverty, injustice, and lack of educational and employment opportunities as likely causes of criminality. Response. For guidance and compassion in addressing the pain of both victims and perpetrators of wrongdoing. Response. For the fortitude to find solutions that protect the dignity of all people and bring about true reconciliation. Response. For the inspiration to the new society on the basis of love and restorative justice. Response. Let us pray. Father of, all, of compassion, you let your rain fall on the just and the unjust. A heart like yours so that we may love as you love. Even those who have caused us pain. There is in through our land a cry for vengeance and a move to fill up their throats and kill offenders, but this cry is a call for justice. Let true and lasting justice spring forth. Jesus, our brother, you suffered execution in the hands of the powerful, but you did not let her good overcome you. Help us to reach out to victims of violence, so that our enduring love may help heal their wounds. Holy Spirit, Lord and giver of life, please strengthen us in the struggle for justice. Help us to work tirelessly against state-sanctioned death and to a new society in truth, justice, love, and respect, so that violence will cease and peace may prevail. Amen. O Mary, Mother of Life, protect the Filipino people from the forces of death. San Lorenzo Ruiz, San Pedro Alonso, St. Paul the Persermit, St. Martin, Patron of the Sick. Amen. Look with kindness upon your people, O Lord, and grant, we pray, like those who are pleased to renew by eternal miseries. May attain in their flesh the incorruptible glory of your resurrection. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated for some announcement. Yung pong ating flooring, ang uh, mga nagbigay po para sa linggong ito ay ang pamilya Kiba, dalawang tiles. Ang pamilya Silverio, 100 tiles. So mayroon tayo total of 102 tiles plus doon sa mga naunang nagbigay, 276 tiles plus 102 equals 378 tiles. So, tayo po yung nagpapasalamat at tayo ay nakakalahati na. 
Pero ipanalangin din pa rin natin sapagkat ang ating target ay 700 times. Tutulad din po ng aking in-announce noong nakalipas na linggo, mayroon na tayong tatlong mga seminarista na uh, tutulong mo sa atin, mag-apostulito sa atin bilang bahagi ng kanilang summer exposure and apostolate. Kung nais ko po silang ipakilala. No? So, si Mark Francis Padua. No? Ay, ito po ay mula sa St. John the Baptist Paris <laughs> ng Calamba City. Rafael Ibarra ganoon sa itaas. From St. Michael the Archangel Paris, Calamba City. Emmanuel Garorillas from St. Augustine Paris, Bay Laguna. Dati ko pong parokya. Dating parokyano. So ito pong tatlong seminarista tulad ng ibinanggit ko po ay sa umaga doon sila sa ampunan sa matandang mga babae na doon sila maglilingkod sa umaga sa hapon dito sila tutulong uh, lalong lalo na po para sa ating sisimula na bukas ang main flower devotion bilang pagkabalangan natin sa mahal na berhen ng mga bulaklak ang mahal na berhen Maria so inaanyahan natin ang mga bata Nanyahan ko pa rin din po yung mga bata ng ibang villages no, na walang, walang alay na pumunta po at makiisa para po sa may unang bahagi po nito ay yung katisismo no? uh, para po sa mas malalim na pagkaunawa ng ating pananampalataya at uh, yung susunod po ay yung pag-aalay panalangin at pag-aalay ng bulaklak sa mga na Beren Maria. At sabi ko nga po ay, sana nga po ay magkakilakilala yung mga bata na sakupan ng parokya. No? Hindi lang sana sa laro, no? kundi para sa Panginoon. No? So kaya po, inaanyayaan ko rin o, no? kasi may nagtanong, Father, paano ba yun? Kasi yung kanya nga po, ay hindi pa nakatanggap ng First Communion. Sabi ko, ay umatin din kayo. Kasi, basta sabihin nyo lamang doon sa coordinator na mga child, meron tayong mga children coordinators at si Sister Edna, yung ating mga katikista, na sabihin lang ninyo na gusto ko kong tumanggap ng unang communion. Kung kayo na sa sapat na naidad, yun ay grade 4 o grade 3 depende na sa assessment ay pwedeng ianda para po sa pagtanggap ng banal na kumunyon we can set one day para naman o sa mismo uh, pagdiriwang ng first communion uh, marami man o kakaunti pero yun po yung ating panawagan ah uh, para sa kalangalan ng mahal na bere ng mga bulaklak, bahagi rin po para magkaroon ng malalim na kaalaman ng ating mga kabataan tungkol sa ating pananampalataya. Pangatlo, ay bukas din ay Labor Day. Ano? Kabistahan ni San Jose Manggagawa. So ating ipanalangin ang lahat ng mga manggagawa na may patubayan ni San Jose. At mayroon nung tayong misa bukas ng umaga. Sa ganap na ikapito ng umaga ay magdiriwang tayo ng misa at idinadalangin natin ang lahat ng mga manggagawa sa pamatnubay at sa halimbawa ang na ipinakita ng ang patrong si San Jose, ang patron ng mga manggagawa. So ipanalangin natin yan sa harapan ng po may kapal. Bukas po, 7 o'clock in the morning. No? 
Sa muli po, maraming salamat sa iyong patuloy na pagsuporta sa ating mga programa at mga proyekto. Magsitayo po kayo. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May the Almighty God bless you all. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Resurrexit Dominus. Alleluia. Alleluia. Deo gratia.